Piggy Bank Billionaire The world's largest piggy bank holds over $8 million. That piggy's probably considering early retirement. Bitcoin Blunder In 2010, a guy named Laszlo Hanyex paid 10,000 bitcoins for two pizzas. Today, those bitcoins would buy a small country. Hope those pizzas were worth it. Cardboard Cash Credit cards were originally made of cardboard and metal. So, next time you swipe that plastic, just think, it used to be more like swiping a cereal box. Coffee Gold The world's most expensive coffee is made from beans eaten and excreted by civic cats. Talk about turning poop into gold, literally. Seven streams of income. The average millionaire has seven streams of income. Meanwhile, I'm here struggling to juggle two jobs and a side hustle. I guess I need to up my game. Bankruptcy banter. The term bankruptcy comes from the Italian word bancarata, meaning broken bitch. It's like the banks were having a furniture malfunction. Millionaire mischief in Iceland. Iceland has the highest number of millionaires per capita. Maybe it's the hot springs inspiring them to strike gold? Chinese paper trail, the first recorded use of paper money dates back to ancient China. They were like the OGs of cash flow, making it rain with paper. Retirement magic, a 20-year-old who saves $100 a month could become a millionaire by retirement. So basically, start saving for retirement or become a magician, your choice. Buffett's early bird special, Warren Buffett bought his first stock at age 11. Meanwhile, at 11, I was still trying to figure out if eating glue was a good investment. Caffeine currency, in some cultures, coffee beans were once used as currency. Imagine paying your rent with a bag of espresso beans, that'd perk up your landlord. Nomophobia nonsense, the fear of being without a mobile phone is called nomophobia. It's like the fear of losing connection is stronger than the fear of losing money. Credit card evolution, credit cards were originally made of cardboard and metal. They've come a long way, now they're more like little rectangles of temptation. Paper power. The first recorded use of paper money dates back to ancient China. They were like, who needs heavy metal coins when you can have this lightweight paper stuff? Icelandic affluence. Iceland has the highest number of millionaires per capita. Maybe they're hiding their wealth in the glaciers. The billionaire bean. The world's most expensive coffee is made from beans eaten and excreted by civic cats. It's like the fanciest cup of coffee has a feline touch. Cardboard credit. Credit cards were originally made of cardboard and metal. It's like they were the original DIY project for financial enthusiasts. Caffeine coinage. In some cultures, coffee beans were once used as currency. Imagine trying to pay for your morning latte with a handful of beans. Colorful cash. People are more likely to remember information when it's presented in color. No wonder colorful bills catch our attention. It's like money's way of saying, remember me. Chinese currency creativity. The first recorded use of paper money dates back to ancient China. They were like, let's make currency that's as versatile as origami. Petabyte power. The brain storage capacity is estimated to be equivalent to 2.5 petabytes. It's like having the ultimate hard drive, filled with memories, cat videos, and financial advice you may or may not remember. Multimillionaire mischief. The world's largest piggy bank holds over $8 million. That piggy must be living its best life. Diamond Dazzle. The phrase, diamonds are a girl's best friend, was coined by a diamond company in the 1940s. They really knew how to bling up a friendship. Marriage Millionaires. Married couples tend to live longer than single individuals. So, not only do they have each other, but they also get more time together. It's like a double win. Finance Fortune Cookies. If you're ever in need of financial advice, just grab a fortune cookie. They're like the mystical sages of budgeting and dessert form. Nomophobia Nonsense. The fear of being without a mobile phone is called nomophobia. It's like we're more afraid of losing our phones than losing our car keys. Bitcoin Banter In 2010, a programmer paid 10,000 bitcoins for two pizzas. That's like buying a mansion with Monopoly money before realizing it's the real deal. Colorful Cash Tricks People are more likely to remember information when it's presented in color. No wonder our wallets always grab our attention. It's a rainbow of financial decisions. Billionaire Beginnings Warren Buffett bought his first stock at age 11. Meanwhile, at 11, most of us were still trying to master the art of not tripping over our own shoelaces. Pizza Cryptocurrency In 2008, a programmer bought two pizzas for 10,000 bitcoins. Today, those bitcoins would buy you a lifetime supply of pizza, or maybe even a small country. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more fascinating tips.